Hi everybody, this is Ms. Montgomery just checking in with some quick logistics information for your midterm. Of course, you have that button in Blackboard with the midterm logistics information, and we'll look at that in a moment, but if you have taken classes or exams on campus before and maybe you haven't in a while there are some differences this semester because of the construction that's going on on campus so first and foremost for our midterm it's going to be available as it says in the syllabus all next week and I'll actually take it over either tomorrow or Friday just to make sure that it's there and so you'll have all week to go and take the exam and the exam is a 75 minute exam it's designed on the timeline of a regular class period so it's an hour and 15 minutes you may hand write or word process as you choose and if anybody has any green sheets to get to me if there are any disability services documentation materials that you need to get to me that is extremely important that that would happen before the exam and then the big change, as you see here, is that the testing center is in F110 right now. So if you have been on campus before but not in a while where the open computer lab used to be, that is now the testing center. You, so you would go to F building room 110. You need to bring photo ID with you because you have to sign in, prove that you are who you say you are, come in to take your exam and you can check out their hours at the link provided you can also use the phone number you can use the email address I'm going to click over then to our course site if you go in from our main page then you go to midterm information see there's a link there to a Google Doc and you have the explanation of everything going on of the two parts of the exam you've got a short answer and an essay part and you notice there are five possible essays there you do not get to choose I get to choose but whatever essay it is going to be is going to be one you'll have seen before here on this handout and again this is an open book exam so you absolutely want to annotate your book and annotate things put in post-it notes if you need to if you have been doing textbook optional you can check with me ahead of time to see about either having a reserved copy on hand or getting me to approve some printouts that you would have with you and I'll take care of explaining all that on the instructions for the testing center employees so that's going to be the procedure for our exam and I wish everybody good luck